Hello, and this is Bard coming at you with a solo Let's Play. I know I really haven't been doing those. I've been focusing on Honest Comic Trailer and everything. I, But enough of that. We are doing Defrag and Descend by Xeno Games. I assume it's Xeno Games as he was bringing up... Okay. 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 I'll give... Actually, you know what? You fall like a brick. I will say. So, um... Yeah, Xeno games, I can't really say anything about them. Uh, I was actually just on um, Game Jolt, and the guy was asking a separate... <laughs> Let's player to, you know, let's play, but hey, why not? So, and then someone else was saying rage quit, but don't know why. I mean, most likely, yeah, it does. I'm assuming it gets harder along the way, you know. Hmm, that one was me. Uh,. Maybe I'm just way too lenient of a gamer. Okie doke. Nah. And, you know, because they were all, oh man, I rage quitted this. And I realize I don't rage, like, I will rage at the dying of the light and everything. I think the freakiest thing. Problem is like WADS plus spacebar is a weird control scheme, but not like unheard of, you know. And it's just something I got to get used to. Although I will say I love the color scheme: blue, <laughs> neon, all Tron, <laughs> neon Tron blue. It's pretty, you know. It's blue on black is always my. F is always a great thing to me. I honestly have no idea what it like. I really wish I could be, you know. Okay. But that's how they're going to get me. It's It's going to be oh hey. You know. Hey. hey. That's right. Okay. But see, it's not that bad of... Like, it's, it, it is a fun, just little thing. And, you know, I'll actually have a link in the description below for any of you guys who'd like to download and play this little chess burster of a game. Nah, it's not a chess... It's, it's not a chess burster. Like, you know, and I do know a lot of gamers who will, you know, probably go, Oh, man! That was so unfair! And really, the controls are tight. It's not like I am bred levels of pissing. You know, it's... Instead of a game that's... Like, it, I can definitely see that it's designed to be challenging. You know, it's designed to be tough. But the controls aren't finicky. A little weird, because, like, I would... I totally think that this would be a lot easier if it were, like... Not wads and spacebar, because you know how stupid fingers are. Mmm! I, I, I'll... But, like, it's like Super Meat Boy in a sense. It is so, ag like, I'm not saying that, you know, no offense to Xeno Games or the actual developer. I don't know the developer's name, so I can't call him out directly. Hmm. But, 
it really is a fun little game. It's like Super Meat Boy, that when you die, it doesn't feel, Oh man, the game is so unfair! But, it's more along the lines of, you, as the player, or at least, on, for me, it's, as the player, you go, oh man, I failed. <laughs> like that. I knew that that was there, and I, but, you know, there's no forward momentum, and the controls are really simple. The design is really simple, but, you know, in a good way. It's not like, were this made on, were this made five years ago, this would probably be a very bare bones looking game, but even bare bones looking games now are really not bad. Like, like I said, I love the neon ninja of it. Hey. Ooh. And that's where it's going to start getting... Like, I just want to go for one minute. That's my... That's my goal now. I just want one solid minute. I know, I know. I'm asking too much, especially since I can't stop talking. Or else my head explodes. No, I'm not that kind of gimmick. It's just... I feel like I let you guys down when I don't talk. But when I'm talking, I'm not really concentrating, and that's just gonna... Because, like I said, this isn't... Inf it's not... When you die, you know that it's because you made the mistake. And that's... This is the kind of... This is kind of frustrating game that I like. What am I at now? I probably won't even make it a full 10 minutes on this video, but it's a quickie, and... Like, it'd be hilarious if they actually changed the colors up later on or something. And... But, um... <laughs> My only thing that I would say that, you know, should change or something like that is maybe, and this is just a maybe, I don't see how it, why it needs to be, you know, this is totally a browser game, you know, I mean, granted on a smaller screen, I think it would lose a lot of its charm. Because on a smaller screen, you could easily get frustrated with going, Oh, I didn't know how to, you know, how it was going to play out. Of course, to be fair, the laptop screen I'm using is pretty large. But... Uh, yeah. Okay, and then... Heh. Uh. Suck it. Okay. And, like, that's just basically it. It's really fun, interesting game that I think everyone should definitely get a little bit, you know, they should they should check it out. It Now, if they polish it up, I think and by polish it up, I mean, you know, add a little bit more charm to it. Maybe, you know, even just like a wraparound store. Oh, they do change the color up. Sweet. Do I have to start at the, do I have to start at the beginning? Yes, I do. Oh, wait. No, I don't. Haha. -ha. Okay. So they add walls in. I like that. Okay, I figured that I'd get crushed. Okay. So...
But, you know, if they maybe put in like... Mm, okay, I didn't know. Oh, I can actually sort of see where they pop up. You know, they put in a small little story. Hell, even just do a, you know, dev a... Hell, do a developer's mod on it. You know, make it a tiny box Tim adventure and, you know, you've got probably a hundred thousand likes or a hundred thousand plays there just by going tiny box Tim tiny brick Tim <laughs> it's a Markiplier thing if yeah uh, I'm fairly certain that the people watching me kind of know who Markiplier is and if not well thank you for coming to me for your, all your let's play needs and by all I mean well, still none. But... I... I think... And it actually keeps a very solid flow and everything like that. I know I'm, you know, cutting in between being an actual decent Let's Player reviewing the game while playing it. Without actually going, oh man! Every four seconds, and I know, I'm sorry, I. Like. Mmm. Okay. So, we're at 11 minutes now, I've been gabbing. So, verdict! Go into the description right now, click it, play it, download it. It is a fun game that you can even play with one hand, although, I will admit, I. Wouldn't recommend it, although I do think that it will come up in a fun... It's got that Bit Trip Runner-y addiction to it, you know, like Bit Trip Runner, Super Meat Boy, where it's going to be a fun, addicting, ah, I got to get to that next level, especially since you now know that there are more than multiple, you know, there's multiple levels, holy hell. Okay, take care.